Good morning, guys. So, I'm about to go to work, but first I have to go get fitted for my tux for the wedding because I leave in four days. And I so can't wait. I am so tired of everybody freezing me out of every place. Look, I have long sleeves on and jeans. Brett thinks the fucking house has to be cold. Work is freezing ass cold. I'm tired of it being cold. When it's hot, I want to be fucking hot. I hate the cold. I get so tired of being cold. It is hot outside. Let's enjoy the heat. We freeze all winter long. Ugh. I should not have to wear long sleeves and jeans in the summer. So I have to go get fitted for this tux and then hopefully everything turns out all right and then be able to take the tux home and then I have to go to work. I'm working like seven days in a row because as a stylist, when you go on vacation, you don't get paid for vacation. You lose money. So I have fit in so many people this week before I leave to kind of make up. So I'm basically working two weeks worth of work in one week. And I'm starting to get tired. Then I'm having to get up at seven o'clock to take Marco to soccer camp. So working so late and going to bed at going to bed late and then getting up early. Oh, it's killing me. It's killing me, small, it's killing me. But I can do it, I can do it, I can make it through the week. Only got four days I can make it through the week. We don't have to get up early on Friday, so camp camp gets over. It's Monday through Thursday. So he'll be done. Or he won't be done with the camp, but Fridays he's off. But he has camp all summer long. So it started the week after school let out. And then it goes until the week that, like it's done the week before school starts. So he gets no break. He has to get up early so he can go to camp. So he gets no break, no sleep in time. Part of doing sports. What happens when you want to do sports? So, but he enjoys it, so we'll let him, let him be. Alright guys, so I'm here to pick up my tux. Tip top tux at Zona. I'm here to get it. Let's go in here and see what happens. All right guys, so got my tux picked up. Everything fits good. You got a small preview, not at the whole thing, but I gave you a small preview. So now I have to go to work. The Before I go to work, I'm going to pick up my best friend's kid from football practice. And then Brett has to go pick up Marco here in a little bit from soccer so it's awesome that he's home because the last two days I've been picking both of them up one gets out 11 one gets out 12 30 and I'm going back and forth and blah 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 and it's just been crazy so he's gonna be picking up Marco but my best friend helps with my kids all the time so I'm always there to help her as well good morning everybody it's Wednesday, yes. Finally got the day right, Wednesday. And, oh, it's June 5th? Yeah. I'm um, at home, I'm on vacation now. It's my first day of my vacation. I'm off for 10 days and Brad goes to Jamaica on Monday. And then um, I'm here with the boys. He comes back, he leaves on Monday, he comes back on Friday. Rafi's here of off school, of course. They got out of school last Friday, it's 31st. Marco's at um, soccer. soccer practice. They have soccer practice and tryouts all 
I don't know how long the tryouts go, but he has like a summer soccer camp thing. Not really camp, but like he has an hour practice every morning from like Monday through Thursday for the whole summer. But he has this other thing he's doing just for this week, which is from, he goes to that from eight to nine, and then another thing from like 10 or so to like 12.30. That's just for this week. He has one more day of that, and then next week, and then the rest of the summer is just from eight to nine, Monday through Thursday. But I don't know exactly when the tryouts are and then when they decide who makes the team and all that sometime during the summer. So he's at that, Brad's at work, and me and Ralph are getting ready to do a test test on these drumstick cereals. We're have all kinds of uh, reviews that we've been um, getting through, and these are the last two things we have to review right now. They have the classic vanilla drumstick and mint chocolate. chocolate. Naturally flaming. Yeah. So we're gonna review those. I think there's pretty much, we don't have too many other things I think that we have to find to review. We've found much of everything. There is a cotton candy Captain Crunch, I think, that's out. I think Target has it, but the last time I was at Target, they didn't have it. And there's a, some strawberry, uh, what was it? I can't remember what it is. Uh, some other cereal. I don't remember what it is. And then, I think that's it. Then there's, there's some new Oreos that are coming out sometime this summer. There's a peach. I don't think it's a peach. It's a, uh, I can't remember either. <laughs> I forget, my mind's leaving me here. There's three different ones. I think there's a coffee one. There's a uh, peach. Oh, a glow in the dark one or something. I think I want those. Yeah, I don't know. It glows in the dark somehow. Anyway, I haven't seen anybody have those. Those probably won't come out till a month or so. So we'll keep checking for those. Anyway, we're gonna do the review real quick before we have to go pick up Marco here in about an hour. So guys, I came in today and I screwed up my whole schedule. I had like a five hour schedule down. I thought I have it on the wrong day. It was supposed to be the 21st, not today. So now I have nothing all day till 5.30. Well, I have one, but that's it. So yeah. Go me. I'm perfect at that. What's up, love? Hi. How are you? Good. There's Renee. Isn't she pretty today? She's Aww. pretty every day. She had a really, really cute shirt on yesterday. It was pretty cute. Mm -hmm. I love that. I need to wear it again. All her clients was wanting it, wasn't they? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we just got back from picking up Marco from soccer practice. And then stopped by the salon, Rafi and Marco got the hair trimmed. Rafi got fresh new trim. He just got it cut on the sides. Trimmed up on the sides and the back. But he kept his color on the top, of course. For the baseball team, if you didn't see our, um, I think it was the Simply Watermelon review. He had it in that review. He did it, colored it red, white, and blue for his baseball team. Because they're Patriots and that's their colors. So him and a few other boys in the baseball team are doing the hair red, white, and blue for the rest of their baseball games. Done. So we got some mail. We checked our P.O. box yesterday and we got some mail. I thought I would open it up here today when we're vlogging. It's from Sense by Kelby, our friend Kelby that makes his own wax melts. He sent us some summer wax melts, he said. So let me open it up here and we'll see what we got. Okay, so here's what he sent us. He has his card in here too. Sense by Kelby, Kelby Baxley. He has his email and the phone number and then the facebook.com slash Kelby Baxley if you need to get hold of him if you're interested in getting some of these. So we have lemon. He sent me a lemon... Um, Lemon sugar before, I think. It was really good. Mm, this is good, too. Mm, such a good, nice lemon set. Just really good for the summer. A little sweet lemon. This is yellow, too. What does it say? Summer Boardwalk. I wonder if that's like Bath and Body Works Summer Boardwalk. Let's smell it and see. Mm, a little bit. It's a little bit similar to it. Has that caramel, caramel kind of carnival 
slightly popcorn. It doesn't smell quite as caramely as Bath and Body Works, but it's, it's good. It smells really good. Strawberry lemon ice. It's got some glitter on there. Mmm. I love that one. It's got a really good strawberry smell with a little bit of lemon, but it's really good strawberry scent. Lime. Oh, he, I love his lime. He's had that. He sent one to us the last time, and it was really good. Oh, yes, yeah, it's so fresh. It's really good and strong. I'm really excited to have another one of those. Then we have Cinnamon Sugar Donut. That's another good one of his we've had. That's just a really good bakery. Cinnamon bakery, donut-y kind of smell. Mmm. I love that one. Then there's s'mores. That'll focus. Got some glitter on there. Mmm. That's good too. Really good chocolate. Like creamy, creamy chocolate goodness in there. I love this chocolate scents too. They're really good. And then we have Beach Waves. Let's see. That's nice. That's kind of, it's got an aquatic water scent to it. Very fresh, watery. It's really nice. I don't have very many kind of, I don't have very many watery scents for summer, so I'm excited about that one. And then last we have pear berry. Hmm. That's nice. You get pear and then like a little bit of a berry note, pretty much what it says. That's good. So yeah, now I got a little so you know, I just have some summer wax melts from him because I don't. I'm running really low on summer uh, wax melts. So thank you, Kelby. And like I said, you can contact him here. His info is on this card here if you're interested in getting some wax melts from him. You can send him a message. All right, so me and Ralph are out. We're getting ready to go to the store in here. Brad was gonna go with us, but. He got called into work. He didn't know he had an appointment. Renee from work called him and told him there was a lady there waiting for an appointment at two and he didn't have her down in his book. He didn't even know who it was. So he's gonna go and be surprised on whoever it is there waiting for a, their hair to be done. Anyway, so, and then we dropped off Marco. His girlfriend had a birthday party. So we went there for a few hours and now it's just me and Ralphie. So we're gonna go to the store here. Brad said he might meet us if, depending on how long his appointment is. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna do that here real quick. Okay, so I'm home. We've been running around all day. Me and Ralphie went to the store and got home. We stopped and got Marco, brought him home. Went back to the store to get some meat. Now Marco's over there. What are you doing over there? I'm eating cheese. The cheese is for the tacos. I'm hungry. Not taking too long. He likes to eat cheese out of the bag. Ralphie's watching some TV here. Maybe I didn't know she was here. Brad's still at work. He had an appointment at 5, 5.30. Should be home any time now. It's been a couple of hours. I think he had a, he was doing Ralphie's friend's sister, pulling some, doing some color in her hair. And just making some tacos. We're having tacos. Just regular tacos with the taco shells. That sounded pretty good tonight. Okay, so Ralphie's best friend's sister's here. We're gonna do turquoise and purple on her hair. So we're bleaching it. Bleach. You have no clue. We're just doing the tips, if you can tell. Say hi. <laughs>
Okay, we are done. <laughs> she looks cute. Okay, so this is the weird lady that walks around this lawn all the time. I don't care. All right, guys. So I'm home from work. I worked till nine something. Came home eight. Getting ready to take a shower and then bed, so I can get up bright and early again tomorrow and work till eight or nine again tomorrow. Hairstylist problems. Had a good day though. So I hope you like the uh, little hair that I did. I know a lot of people ask for me to do that all the time, so I did do that and recorded some of it for you guys so you guys could see me do some of my work. What'd you turn that on for? I'm the live guy. I guess so. Oof. Mark was over there eating I'm always banana. doing that by seeing so I'll turn a little line up for you. Mark was eating a banana. Ralphie's laying in bed getting ready to go to bed. Good morning everybody. It's Thursday morning. Today's uh, June 6th. I just dropped Marco off at soccer practice. And now I'm over here waiting for Brad and Ralphie at this playground over here, not too far from our house. Brad's sister is coming to clean this morning. She's coming at eight o'clock and that's when Marco has soccer practice. So I tried to wake everybody up. I got up, took a shower, got ready. Tried to get everybody else up, but nobody was wanting to get up. But um, Brad finally got up right before I left. He said he didn't sleep very well. He has that what is it, plantar fasciitis on his feet? I think it's, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. I think it's how you say it. Um, sometimes he can't sleep very well. And uh, like he woke up and he was limping really bad because his feet hurt him so bad. He had a doctor appointment for it, but they gave him some pills, I think, but they don't really help him very well. But anyway, um, so he got up and he was eating breakfast when I left. So he's just going to, in a little bit leave with Ralphie and come over here at the playground because his sister's gonna be there to clean we don't like to be there in her way when she's clean so usually it takes her two to three hours to clean so we'll Ralphie wanted to go to the playground yesterday so we'll let him play this little playground over here it's not a real big playground but you know it's got it's a decent little playground and then I have a doctor appointment at 10 15 uh, for my gastroenterologist doctor, for my stomach, I have to see her every six months just for like an update, oh, like a six month update. I see her twice a year. Um, so I have to do that. And I think that's it. Brad works today. Picked up Marco at 12.30 when he gets done. So yeah, I have, um, I have to take a couple of shirts back to American Eagle today that I bought that didn't fit right. So yeah, I brought my laptop here with me while I'm waiting for the uh, Brad and Rafi to get here and I'm gonna do some editing while I'm waiting for them to get here. And also our drive-through challenge video that we did, 
it uh it's doing really good it's like a 10,000 subscribers I think this morning I checked it's up to 10 or not subscribers 10,000 views um, as of this morning it's like I think our sixth or seventh most viewed video we've ever done and we gained quite a few subscribers from this video we've gained we're getting like 50 subscribers a day 50 or more a day so it's jumped quite a bit I think because of that video because all people are seeing that video so that's awesome We'll probably try to do another one, I think. Maybe next week. I thought maybe next week mom's coming down to spend the night. And Brad's in Jamaica, so some people said it'd be cool to see mom and Aunt Shirley do it. Aunt Shirley's not coming with her, but um, mom is. We thought about doing that challenge with mom, so she's coming down, so we'll see. But at the same time, now that we're getting that a lot of views on that video, we're getting a lot of trolls. A lot of people that haven't been to our channel before are commenting and leaving some not so great comments on that video and other videos even. So that's the only bad thing. You get a lot of people that don't normally watch your videos and trolls and stuff and yeah, that's been kind of fun. But that's what happens when your video gets a lot more views, you get all, that kind of brings out the trolls. So. Anyway, I'm going to do some editing real quick while I wait for Brad and Ralphie to get here. Okay guys, so we went to the park and everything and now I wanted to stop and wash my car. I haven't washed it forever. It's filthy, filthy, filthy. We've had nothing but rain, so haven't been able to wash it. Okay, so me and Ralphie Ride that just, hey. just left my doctor appointment and now we're at Kansas. the Legends outlet over here Kansas. in Kansas where I have to return some shirts to American Eagle that didn't fit right. And then after that, there's a Bath and Body Works out here. I might have to check the Bath and Body Works to see if there's anything. They have wallflowers on sale. I kind of took a break from using those, but Brad needs a couple for work because he uses one in the bathroom at work. I don't know, I might get some from home. We we haven't used them for like three or four months now. I've been using little wax melt warmers in my, like little Scentsy plug-ins in the, plug in the bathrooms and using those. I like wallflowers, but they're kind of hit and miss anymore. And they have a little yellow brick road thingy here that's pretty cool. This is like an outdoor mall. It's it's just like a mall, but there's like no roof, pretty much.
They have a lot of cool stores. That's the Adidas outlet over there that I got my shoes for $38. They got really good prices at things down here. So he just exchanged my two shirts. I got two ones that fit better. So now we're gonna go to the Bath and Body Works to see what they have in here. They have this new graphite men's fragrance. I wanted to smell it here. It smells pretty good. Do you like it? I didn't smell it. Can't smell it really well though. It smells like corn. Smells like Here. Hold this card and I'll spray some of this on here. Hold it out a oh, little. There you go. Mmm, that's all good. Mm, it does good. smell good. Here's a salted pretzel milkshake we've been talking about. I think it smells pretty good. It has some similarities to Summer Boardwalk, but I don't think it's nearly as overwhelming like that is. It does have like a caramely type of note to it. I'm gonna have to get that. I kind of like it. Okay, so they didn't have much new at Bath and Body Works, except for that salted pretzel milkshake candle. I think they'll have more stuff at the SASL that starts either this Sunday or Monday, so I'll have to um, check back then to see if they have anything newer than what they have now. All right, so Jeffrey came in. He had to get his wedding haircut and shape up on the beard before the wedding. <laughs> Looks good. Last minute before you're a husband. Okay, so I'm doing pretty good today at work. The owner brought me a caramel macchiato from Starbucks. And my client, which is my cousin, brought me long boards. She brought me a pork luau, which is really good. And then, you can't really see it, but she brought me some sliders too for lunch with three different kinds of dipping sauces. Long boards is the Shneznik. It's really freaking good. I don't think it's all over in the country. I almost promise you it's not. Because the first one was um, on North Oak where we live. That was the first one. And then they've opened up some others in other towns around us. But I'm sure as it goes, they're going to have a lot more around. So, but it's really freaking good. I love longboards. So I'm back here and I'm eating Why everybody else out here is working. They're all working. I'm back here eating. So I'll just be back here eating before my next client. So... We're at Starbucks right now because we have a gift card. Brad found a gift card in his wallet, but we didn't know who it was from. We cannot remember where it was from. I'm like, he thought it was a subscriber. I'm like, I don't think so. We haven't got a gift card from a subscriber in quite a while. But Ralphie says it's from a client at work, and I think it was too, but Brad doesn't remember who it was. I'm pretty sure it was a client at work that gave him that gift card. So, we're gonna have Starbucks today. Brad said we could use it. He's getting some Starbucks at work today, and then we're gonna get it. I told him I could bring him a Starbucks. He said uh, they're gonna get some at work. So I think Renee was buying them all Starbucks or something at work. So we went for me and Ralphie, and we're gonna get one from Marco, and we're gonna pick Marco up from soccer practice, and we'll have some for him. Can already be picked up? 
Now we got six minutes before I'd be there. We should make it on time if they hurry up here. There's one car in front of me. I think they're just about done. So I thought I'd show you, we got a Starbucks. Marco got him a caramel frappuccino. Ralphie got the mocha, mocha frappuccino. He forgot to put the cream, yeah, so I he got coffee. I forgot to say cream, so he got coffee in there, but oops, he'll be all right. It's not gonna kill him. Yeah, I forgot, you always have to say cream frappuccino, otherwise I'll put that coffee in there. And then I got a salted cold foam with and the caramel macchiato. It's caramel macchiato with the salted cold foam on the top there. And it looks really good. Let me try it. Mmm, that's good. Let me try it. Mm. It's kind of salty, but like creamy and foamy. And, mm, it's really good and caramely. I like it. All right, so now we gotta go pick up Marco. So me and Rafi went home, and now we're getting ready to go over here at this Bath and Body Works to see what they have, and they have wallflowers on sale, so I'm gonna pick some up over here. But first, I'm gonna stop at Hot Topic to see if they have any plugs, because I need some new plugs. And I do too. Hey, me. You don't need plugs, your ears aren't gauged. Huh? I said your ears aren't gauged, so you don't need plugs. had some silver ones that I had a couple years ago that I lost one of them though one of them fell out and then I only had one and hold on a second there we go and uh, I can't find any like them anymore I even look online and I can't find any quite like those pair I'll just have to keep checking because I've had these black ones forever and I wanted something a little different Okay, so nothing new with this Bath and Body Works either. Same old thing as the other one had. She said they do have some new stuff, of course, coming up Monday for SES, but I got seven wallflowers and a hand sanitizer for Brad's car. All right, guys, so Sarah waxed my nose. No, I wasn't Carrie. happy. No, wait. We both did. I wasn't happy with it. So then I had Carrie do it, and Sarah was showing Carrie, and she shoved it so far up my nose it took my brain and eyeball <laughs> with it. I don't have an eyeball, because she took it with it. In all fairness, I trained her on the first nostril, and he asked, and I, well, if you want to keep learning, you could do the other, and that's when regret hit. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the second drink. It always gets you. It's the second shot that always kills you. She just tried to shove it all the way up it's there. The it's the second yeah. nostril. She wants yeah. all the hairs out. At least I don't have any hair in my nose for Jamaica. Hey, and your snot no hair blows at out really easily, you can <laughs> All right, guys, and the vlog here, we're getting ready to head to bed. So this will be our last vlog before Brad goes on vacation I to really Jamaica. I it's vacation, but... Are you going to Jamaica? Yeah, I am going to Jamaica. Please. I'm excited, but I'm not excited. I'm excited because I've never been out of the country, but I'm not excited because the boys and Brett can't go, but it's so freaking expensive. Is. It would have been way expensive for us all to go. Yeah. We and would have been paying on that forever. Yeah. And they asked me to get ordained and marry them. So I kind of have to be there. Yeah. He leaves Monday. Early Monday morning comes back Friday evening. Yeah. Alright. So thanks for watching. Please comment, thumbs up, subscribe if you're new. We'll see y'all in the next vlog. Good night. Good night, y'all.